Okay, so I just saw something online <laughs> that kind of, I was like, oh wow, okay, here's where we are. In this world of chat GPT and AI and all of this, you know, people are actually using chat GPT to help interpret their dreams. I have something to say about that. <laughs> I live with the conviction, and this has been my experience, not just in my own life, but in helping people over the years understand and interpret their dreams, and obviously throughout biblical scripture and what I see in the Bible. Dreams are one of the languages of heaven. They are spirit communicating to spirit, and only that which is spirit can give understanding of that which came from the spirit. I think about John, the revelator, when he opens up the book of John, you know, it's talking about Jesus and being the light of the world. And he says, he says a phrase in there. He says, the darkness could not comprehend the light. It's the same with our dream world. Anything that is lacking the light of God cannot comprehend what God is trying to communicate through a dream. Don't submit your dreams that God has given you at night to something like ChatGPT to try to understand what God is communicating to you. It won't be able to comprehend it. It's, it's coming from a different place. This is not just grammar. This is not just like a, a regular language. This is a heavenly language. This is, this is being communicated through spirit. And this is what actually separates biblical dream interpretation from several other methods. We rely on the partnership and the revelation of the Holy Spirit to give understanding of what dreams mean. ChatGPT can't do that. Only God can do that. <laughs>